Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So right now I have a haul video. I've been filling hauls like no other. Um, so I have an affordable makeup haul for you guys. I've been waiting for this package to like come in so I can film this for you guys. But this is going to be just an affordable haul of some very affordable products. How many times can I say affordable? Anyways, this is a site that I came across through YouTube by just kind of searching affordable sites for makeup. It is called iKateHouse.com. Um, I will link it down below. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I picked up a few items on there. Like I said, everything is affordable from like NYX. They have ELF. They have Milani. They have everything that you can think of. So I'm just going to jump right in. This shouldn't be too long. Um, but I'm going to kind of show you guys what I got. And hopefully that inspires you to kind of check this site out and buy some products yourself. So I'm going to break it down to face. I have lips and then like kind of some tools and brushes and stuff. And I have everything on this site you can think of. Like everything, I fell in love. So with face products, I started off with uh, the Milani Conceal and Perfect. You guys know I've used this one before, um, but in the drugstore, you know they only go to shade tan. Um, so I'm trying golden tan. Tan was like a half shade too light for me. Um, so I'm gonna try this one. If this one doesn't work, I'm probably gonna try the next shade. Um, but you guys know this foundation is like super full coverage. It's one of the best drugstore foundations out there like it's at the top like it's super full coverage i love it i just can't get enough of it next thing i got was like obviously more face products i wanted to try the la girl um like bronzing sticks and like highlighter sticks i haven't opened any of these so i would do some swatches but this is the bronzing stick it's kind of like shimmery and i got this one in i don't know what color is this Oh, brazen, brazen. Okay, so I'm gonna look like a brazen. Uh, so this is what it looks like. You guys know you will see these in future tutorials, so I'm excited. And then I got the highlight contour stick, and this one is in luminous. And this one's a really pretty, like pale pink highlight. You guys know I'm more into like the wider, more pinky highlights more than gold. Um, just because I don't really like how the gold looks on my skin. I'm just not into that. Then I just picked up LA Girl Concealer, of course, in Fawn. You guys know this is my jam. I haven't used this in so long, but i kind of been like reaching towards it again. So it's always good to stock up. And these are literally like $2.99 or like $1.99 on the site. It's, it's amazing. Then I got the Beauty Treats Face Powder uh, Contour Kit. It looks like so. Um, so it comes with like pretty much like highlighting shades and then two bronzer shades. This one's a shimmery highlight and it's kind of like a, if you can see the sheen there. Um, I really, I'm excited to try this out. I think this one's literally like only $3.99. If you ever heard of Beauty Treats, they kind of sell these kind of like beauty supplies or like kind of like 99 cent stores or like little stores like that. Um, they usually have really cool like palettes and face stuff and all types of makeup for very cheap. So I want to say this one was only like $3.99. So I decided to try it out. I don't actually own a contour kit. So I just wanted to try one out. So I'll let you guys know how I like this one. So that's all I have for face. You guys know face products are my favorite, but I couldn't really think of anything else that I wanted to try on there. They kind of just have the generic stuff that I already have. So I'm going to move on to lips, which I'm super excited about. So I got three uh, lip pencils um, from LA Girl, and I saw another YouTuber um, who purchased um, the full pack of these so you can buy this like most stuff individual or they'll give you a bundle price I didn't want to buy all of them just because I knew I wouldn't use the shades So I'll just kind of look at the shades that I like um, but I got these three and perfect brown perfect brown is like so that one's perfect brown. you guys know I live for the brown lip like lips liners that's all I use then I got this one in chocolate. This one's gonna be my fave. So chocolate is next to perfect brown. I know I'm gonna use that one a lot. And then I got this one in brick, I believe. So I'll kind of put these guys together. So they're in that brown family type thing. And these are super smooth and creamy as I'm swatching them. I know I'm gonna like these. And I wanna say these are literally only a dollar on the site. 
Then I got three liquid lipsticks. You guys know liquid lipsticks are everywhere. So I wanted to try them. I've seen these around. These are by Nika K. Um, and it's called like the matte. So I got this one in a pale pink. This one is Santa Fe. Here, let's see. If I swatch that one. That one is here, which is really pretty pink. And you guys know I always pair my pinks with like a brown lip liner. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then I wanted to try a red. I've been seeing red lips go around, obviously because it's the holidays and you can't get away from red for the holidays. Um, so this one is in Shiraz. Don't know how to pronounce that one. But I wasn't, it's really hard to find the perfect red shade. So I would just kind of just kind of wing oh they smell really good so that is the red shade this is like a pure red um so this will be super cute for the holidays like a simple look and a bold lip probably plan on doing something like that for you all then i wanted to try the um milani amor matte creams and i got this one in sugar i'm definitely going to go back and get some more of these i just kind of want to try out the formula before i bought like a bunch of them and like didn't like the formula so i'm gonna swatch this one and this one's like a deep like ooh, I like that deep purple so that's what that one looks like it's right there and then this is what they look like so I'm for sure gonna like that all right so that's it for the lips I just kind of wanted to try different products and lip lip liquid lipsticks uh, just to kind of get feel for the formula but the matte ones like these are only a dollar so I'm probably if I like the formula I'm probably gonna go back and just like get all of them just because you can't beat a liquid lipstick for a dollar and then I want to say the Milani ones are about six or seven dollars which is still not bad so after that I just kind of picked up some tools I just kind of want to touch each category um, so I picked up a few tools they do sell brushes on there which is really great and they're super affordable um, so I picked up two brushes from Cara Beauty I want to say I want to go back and get more of the Cara Beauty line just because they're super pretty it's nice black and gold this one is a blending brush I got two blending brushes just because you can't have enough blending brushes so this is the car k17 and it's that natural hair like fluffy blending brush and i saw it and it's literally like two dollars so i probably should have bought all of them but i just wanted to try them out and see how they work and then i'll go back and buy more so that's i'm really like i think i'm gonna like this brand and then i got a beauty sponge uh just a new beauty sponge can't go wrong with those and then I got the brush egg little brush cleaner. I, Lord knows I need to clean my brushes. Like, I'm really bad about cleaning my brushes. I only clean like the few that I use, but I have tons of brushes and I'm like, I just spot clean them. I haven't like actually deep cleaned my brushes in who knows how long, which is very unsanitary. I know you don't have to tell me, but I at least spot clean them. I mean, I'm cleaning them. Uh, so I did want to try, you guys know a lot of these type of brush type cleaning applicators are coming out with you know little pads little things that clean them so i really want to try this out and see if it really gets deep down in there and clean the brushes if you guys know any good brush cleaners that will be good with these type of things link them down below and let me know down below i kind of want to try a nice brush cleaner uh, so that is all i got from my haul i think i got a pretty good amount of stuff just to kind of try them out and try out the formulas of everything uh, just because you never know how it is going to be obviously you kind of get what you pay for but there are a lot of affordable brands out there that have bomb products and i've tried la girl before milani like those are super affordable companies that have bomb products so i love them so much so i will let you guys know what i think about these and kind of do a full face with using some of these products you guys know you'll see them in future tutorials um so without that like i said i'll link uh, iKate house down below if you guys are interested in ordering anything from there but that's all I have for you guys for my little small makeup haul. There will be more fashion hauls coming soon. Thank you guys so much for supporting me and just everything you guys do and comment and all that stuff. I really read these and they really make me feel good and it keeps me going. So thank you guys so much for watching.